New technology may help monitor people like Reisman. A breathalyzer test can only monitor a person's drinking about that, uh, the time of that day, but now scientists can look at blood and fingernail samples to uncover a person's drinking history months into the past. They look for something called biomarkers in the blood and fingernail samples. The Human Services Center in Rhinelander uses biomarker technology. They use data from the results to see if OWI treatments are effective. If it's being successful, if we've put somebody in treatment that is not getting a benefit from it, um, now we can know that really in black and white terms. They can track alcohol history back 90 days with fingernail samples. The center has more than 200 biomarker cases from Oneida, Vilas, and Forest counties. Only second offense OWI offenders who had a blood alcohol content above .15 are admitted to the program. Case workers see results. They're more conscious of, um, oh, I cannot drink now because I'm under the biomarker program and I am more accountable for my actions and behavior now. The center wants the program to grow into a regular practice because they think it can cut costs. U.S. drug testing laboratories put 10 months of monitoring at about $300 per driver in the program. It costs Wisconsin $90 each day a person is in jail.